Hey guys, it's Rick with HelpingDollarLitter.org. I'm today here today at the Treasure Montessori School. How are you guys doing? We're doing what's great. your name, young lady? This is Kathy. Kathy Waters. Kathy, and what's your name? I'm Katie. How you doing, Katie? I'm well, great. listen, I'm over here doing something else. We're doing something for the haunted house, and I kind of saw what you guys are doing in here. And of course, we have Helping Dot Litter also with Isabella, whom y'all have met. And uh, tell everybody what you're doing here. Repurposing so this is awesome. We are in our aftercare program, and we um, for the students to stay after school and we have some time with them but we decided that one of our activities that we're going to do is recycle water bottles and rather than just recycling them we wanted to make a craft with them so we are repurposing um, what would end up in the trash and or recycle bin and we're trying to make some art out of this we're going to the kids the students have been busy painting all of our plastic fish you might be able to see the fish outline here oh, we cute. will add some details on those later and right. we're going to hopefully make some um, of an art installation for the students here in Treasure Village Montessori. Well, I think this is fantastic because you're teaching kids. It's an educational thing, helping the environment. And Lord knows you're not going to have any trouble finding plastic bottles, are you? There's plenty. Of <laughs> we have so many more that, you know, we can make art for the whole keys. Exactly, <laughs> yeah. exactly. So what are you making over here, young lady? Um, I'm making a fish, but I think that this project is really cool because, for one thing, recycling all these bottles and stuff, it keeps it out of the oceans, out of the mangroves, out of... The trash, pretty much, right? And it makes it into a work of art that's created by the students here at Chisholm Village. And it actually, once the mobile is done, it would, I think, it would look pretty cool. Yep. When you can combine education, teaching kids how to do things, with saving our environment, I think it's just like about 100 percent there. So, thank you guys for telling us about it and let me come in here and just bounce in our here because I, I saw what you were doing and saw the bottles and. Uh, it's a personal thing of mine, the, 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 the trash is, that's why I, I sync so well with Isabella on this because it's such a big problem in our society and students like you guys, like this one over here, are doing fantastic. I'm proud of you guys, okay? All right, everybody take care. What's up, buddy, over there? What's your name again? David. David. I remember you from, uh, you, were, you went out with us on a boat right one time, didn't you? Yep. Because you're related to these guys. <laughs> anyway, all right, guys. So well, everybody take care, and we'll talk to you later from cmybeach.com. I'm from cmybeach.com, and also helpandalllitter.org. Got to have 15 jobs nowadays to make any money. Thanks. We'll see you guys later. Thanks, bye. Oh, only I don't get paid from Isabella. But anyway, see y'all later. Thanks. Bye-bye.